you know, think about your game plan beforehand. I'm sure that AK has been thinking that he was going to, if he wanted a chance to win this tournament, then eventually he would have to come across knee. I mean, this guy is the one with the target on his head right now. So AK, uh, a big decision to make right now as to what character he's going to go for. Um, yeah, and, and we're saying that per perhaps the 2D will come here. But I do think from knee that we're going to see the thing. Yeah, I mean, I, I'm, I'm really interested to see who which character AK is going to pick. I feel like Akuma is probably a smart pick to kind of check things out. But he's going to go with Shaheen. We're going to have mm. a nice, honest main character match for both of these players. Obviously, current main character for Ni. Nee. Let's see how this plays out. We are in the Dragon's Nest. Yes, it's going to be a battle of uh, of pokes and, and pure 3D Tekken right here. You know, AK versus Ni. Nee. Philippines versus Korea. Let's get into it. Who's going to meet Chikorin in the winner's finals of this tournament? Yeah, and actually, this is a rare matchup because we don't often get to see these players play each other. Not too much. It's been very rare throughout the course of Tekken 7's career. Mm. And recently, Ni nee went to uh, the Philippines, right? And he, I guess, had his worst performance that he's had all year. Yeah, he actually did not make it out of pool. It's crazy. He lost to Runner Black. I, that, I don't need that, to say that, anything that, else. Yeah, we, we don't use this English more. We don't talk but about yeah, that, that, even though I love him. He's from San Diego, but yeah, let's not talk yeah. about that. Anyways, yeah. going into the wall here, the follow up. Is that dead? Yes, it is. AK strikes first blood here, gets around on the board. Yeah. That was a hood perfect. He was able to really uh, do it in nice fashion. Mm -hmm. And you know, uh, Ni actually lost to a Feng player from the Philippines as well, right? Uh, Titan Thor. So, I mean, they have... Uh, Philippines is such a is such a big scene as well. They have a lot of players, but they definitely have the Fengs as well. I mean, they have... You know, honestly, we'll talk about it. I know you wanted to mention it as well. Their scene, they use every character over there. They have crazy Mishimas. They have good Steve players. They have every character. They, they, they study the game just like everyone else. Mm -hmm. it's just the players don't have the uh, exposure or they don't have uh, the opportunities to play at the world level. Mm, yeah. Okay, but AK is looking very solid here at the moment as well, man. Going for blow for blow against Knee, and the clock is whittling down. He has the life lead. Oh, nice. Oh, no. He gets the wall bounce as well. This is going to hurt. Ugh. Oh, look at that damage. Yeah, crazy damage there with the down 4 2 2 wall bounce. What a great combo from Knee. One round apiece. That down 4-2-2 two, two, and then he hits him with that down 4-3 to prop him even higher into there to really get that meaty combo. It's mm -hmm. beautiful. You love to see it. Yeah. And right now, and knee with the offense. Yeah, definitely, man. Just just going up a notch a little bit here with the aggression. Just smothering AK at the moment. Trying to go for the parry. One way he's going to do it and that is going to be a 7 goal to let his knee right. turning it up here. Fight. All right. AK is going to have to make some decisions here right now. He's in big trouble because Nii starting to wake up, remembering like, oh, this is why no one uses Shaheen. <laughs> but down forward too, man. The problem move of Shaheen, the uppercut, beautiful timing. Going to be a nice combo. Let's see if he can keep that wall positioning. Uh-oh. Oh, yeah. This is where Nii wants him. He wants him back to the wall, continue with the pressure. I feel like AK, there's a lot of ways he can get out. He could go for slide. He could go for a throw. But, but, but landing it on Nii, that's oh, the other question. Not going to get the combo there. Yeah, he got fortunate with the side wall splat. And he wasn't able to uh, get another combo. But nice, there we go. Final round, first game, AK. Can he I feel like this out? is always the case for the first game. It's always final round. And from there on out, it's pretty much... I don't know. We'll see. We'll see if this happens like it usually does. Mm -hmm. Good break there from AK. Man, so much going on right now. And Nii is doing a good job. He's kind of mixing up his offense and defense as well. Nice, crack nice. the ankles. Mm -hmm. He's got to be careful though because that move is so linear and Ni obviously great with his movement. He might be able to get around, but you can't get around that Nigi Appa. Yeah, talking about movement there, man. The AK sidewalk into the down 4 2. Look at the damage as well. Can he close out? But that's the question. Ooh, Go to the side. He will. That should be dead. AK. Damn, AK drawing first blood here. I feel like we were talking about this yesterday when we were talking about players to watch out for. I feel like, I think I told you straight up, I was like, I feel like AK can take it. In, if no, they were pl to play each other. Did I say that on stream or did I say that off stream? You said it on stream, but okay. you said it off stream. You said it, off you said it both off stream. You did say, you said AK is definitely the one to look out for here, in your opinion. And, you know, he's definitely uh, meeting your expectations at the moment as he takes the first match. We're going to the Mishima Dojo now. So, you know, 
uh, walls are still going to be in play, but um, a bit of a different shape. So maybe those rage drives won't give the, the side wall splats um, as easily for knee. But let's see if we can bring it back now. Like you said, uh, Mark, the first match is always very close, but the battle of adaptation, that's where it gets interesting. Adaptimentation station. And another reason why I really want to give a shout out to AK is again because his playstyle and his timing is so different. It's all on the player that he's going up against to make those adjustments to see if they can fight back and take their turns back. Because again, AK is one of those players, like you think it's your turn, but it's not. He's going to get down, get you with that down forward too. He's going to get you with that slide. So let's yeah. see what Nii does here. I mean, Nii is the guy. You know, if he, anyone's going to make an adjustment real quick, it's him. And right now we're seeing AK show his versatility in Tekken. You know, people know him as to be that kind of unpredictable guy, that kind of wild, but very solid at the same time. But right now, he's not doing anything too crazy. Just playing very fundamental, very um, very calm, you know? And and he has a life here versus me. Yeah, but I mean, he has to be careful. His back's still the wall. Last time he had this uh, positioning in this situation, he ate that big wall bounce combo. So again, he has to be very careful. Definitely, but the clock is whittling down. Last 10 seconds, good break on the throw from me. Oh, the nice duck! duck. Wow, he was ducking right away. He was locked and loaded. Look, look at that. Good stuff, AK yeah, we, taking that opening round. We even saw Nii, you know, nodding in approval to that to that duck. He's like, yeah, okay, now that was good. That was good. Oh, I like it. He's changing it up. He is playing a very unorthodox style from what he was playing even just the round before. Mm-hmm. I think he wants. I think he wants me to kind of go to him into attacking. I think that's what he's going for here. Uh, yeah, you, I mean, everyone knows Ni is a defensive kind of player, right? He he likes to get people to come in and test his defense, and usually he comes out on top. But AK now, you know, meeting him with the patience and saying, Do you know what? I want you to test my defense as well. But look at this though, nice combo, and Ni has a positioning. Yeah, that was great, and the patience finally paid off. He got the block on the slide, got the combo, and he was able to take this round eventually. So good stuff to Ni for making that adjustment, that quick block. You know, Ni has traditionally been one of those players, and I think a lot of people would probably try to call out in the past, is he usually doesn't duck. But with the intention there, he knew he had to, to get that momentum back. Yeah, definitely. He knows when to do it, man. He has that, that great presence of mind. Super, super close set right now. And a lot of these rounds are going right down to the wire. The clock's going down to the last 10 seconds. Look at the patience from both players. Yeah. Oh my god, the duck under the back one. The back one's starting to, to come out as well. Me using a little bit more of the arsenal. Feeling a bit more comfortable at how he's going to be approaching against AK. But again, yep. like I said, it's 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 so hard to kind of call out. You see AK, he's like whiffing that down forward too from like one range. But he, he's not, he's trying to clip someone. That's what he's trying to do. That's entirely part of his game plan. He is so good at utilizing that at a range where it's hard to whiff punish as well. Oh, the hot Oh, kick. yes. No! Oh, oh my god, how did that all drop? He dropped oh, him. Oh. He caught him, and now Knee is in the lead in terms of life. Again, I used it. I don't. Yeah, he didn't press a button. Huge drop there from AK. And uh, like we said before, those are the kind of things you can't be dropping, especially when you're playing up against Knee, because he will take advantage of it. And now Knee is one round away from evening up this set. You know, I wasn't even thinking about this earlier, but you know, Chikorin in the prior match, I just thought about it, beat Chanel and sent Chanel to the loser bracket. So that's going to make it even harder because he just beat Arsenash 3-0 earlier. Because I, I was thinking like along the same lines you that Arsene's going to come out all the way from the loser side. But now he has the guy that just beat him up earlier. Yeah, he's going to have to get the run back, man. It's not going to be easy. No matter who went into that loser bracket, it was going to be tough either way. Uh, man, he's just super, super stacked at the moment. But look at this from AK. He takes it to a final round. I'm loving this, Mark. Well, the reason I brought that up is if you think about it, one of these two monsters that's on the screen right now is going to go to the loser bracket as well. That's going to be messed up. Scary thought. Very scary thought. And it could be me if AK takes this round and the next match. Bro, what is he doing? How is he playing this? Oh, oh my god. god. Oh, and he got the float in the Oh, he's trying to convert. Yo, AK is, is playing out of his mind. But those were all small pokes. You got to get the big ones. You got to get the launchers. Mm-hmm. Yo, oh, gosh. he knows the range too of using that. It makes it really difficult for Feng to get a clean punish on it as well. Chipping away at the leg. Chipping away. Oh, the oh. kill kick. AK coming to life. What's he going to do now? He's he trying to get him. Knee is not biting though. Knee is not biting. He's not falling for it. He's quite happy to take these small little lows. Orbital. Okay. Jesus. Oh. 10 seconds Lime. left. This is where Nii's comfort zone is. He is he's chill. He's he's good. Oh the train! The train! 
Yes, knee. The defense holding up, man. I love that from knee as well. He didn't panic. He knew that, you know, it's been a very, very even set, but he trusted enough in his defense to be able to stay calm and get the job done. But we have to say, though, Mark, there were a couple of drops there from AK in that match, which could have seen him win that set, that match. Yeah. Uh, you can't be dropping those, man. But I'm, I'm liking this. This is sick. One match apiece. Can you believe it? These rounds have been going all the way down to the wire each time. Yeah. And, and the crazy thing here, it could have been easily 2-0. It could have easily been 2-0. But Nii fighting back, making sure he takes his, his that momentum. And look at this. We're going to the Howard Estate now. And it, I, arguably, this is a stage where AK is most comfortable just because of the, the damage and... Again, this is his go-to. This is his go-to stage. Yeah, we saw what he was able to do against Sir uh, on this stage as well. That crazy combo to finish the round and match. But yeah, let's see if he can bring it back. Okay. Unfortunately, the rounds aren't counted. It's the numbers that you see at the top of the screen that is going to matter. It is one match apiece. The way that Nii's kind of approaching this now, he just used 4 4 4, trying to catch AK in his tracks, trying to beat out maybe what AK's trying to do with that sidestep uh, right down forward, too. Mm -hmm. Oh, I love it how they just play. They're just waiting in front of each other's faces, looking for those opportunities. Now, AK, oh, got the read there on the low parry, but he dropped oh, the combo without very uncharacteristic drop because that could have been an easy wall combo. 1 3 into the shoulder. Oh! Sick. Yo, 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 when do you see that land? Yeah, you never you rarely see that. You rarely see Shaheen's, man. But dashes up and goes for the homing move to catch knee sidewalking. So that's very, very good. AK now takes the first round. Nice. Ooh. Again with the low parry knee. Getting a read on the timing. This time getting the wall combo. The follow keeping that pressure at the wall here. AK's going to have to get out of there. Okay, he was ready for it. He went for that down forward too. Not yeah, but that was the wrong... That was the wrong punish on the down two. That's only minus 12, not 13. And Nii is going to take full advantage and get that round on the board and answer back. We're all evened up here. Fight. It's these small pokes, man. This is what it's, 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 like we said at the start of the match, it was going to be a battle of poking here. Haven't seen a lot of back tempo though, Mark. No, it's like he kind of sealed it away from his repertoire. Nii hasn't used it really throughout the entire day. It's very rare that we've seen it. Mm-hmm. I wonder if we're going to start seeing it soon. The back tempo can be very, very good to beat these little pokes. Oh, oh nice whip punish from AK. That was crazy. Able to get the counter hit crack there. Mm -hmm. Dash up down forward two. Life lead with AK. Knee's going to start going in with the lows. Oh, my gosh. Oh, nice. the edge. That's the problem of having that down forward two hit at the edge as well. Is sometimes those combos will end up whiffing. And that's the second time we've seen it already in this set alone. Oh, nice okay. conversion. Knee able to uh, save it. Slide you! Not oh, enough dead. to kill though. Not enough to kill, uh -oh. of course. Oh my gosh. Knee <laughs> really? Knee, knee, knee doesn't have it in him. He don't got the dog in him. But he actually ducked there. That The balls actually duck in that situation as well. AK, so, so good. And now he's turning up the heat now. A bit more aggression. Nice low parry. Here we go. He's going to push towards the wall. Gets the side wall and the conversion still, but of course not going to get the wall break. But AK playing up close. AK looking to take the lead here. But he's put into the red. And he doesn't break the throw. And look at that, man. Final round in the third game. And Nii, you know, deciding to turn up the heat a little bit. And the aggression. This is where Feng definitely shines in that close range. AK, how can you answer back? Oh, boy. A, a, a master class on spacing. And kind of getting a read on, your, on the rhythm of your opponent. Yeah, definitely, man. Patience again from both sides. He's pushing AK slowly and slowly to that wall, but down forward one's adding up. Here we go! Yo, he's been using the shoulder and getting the whip punish on the shoulder quite a bit now. He is ready to pull the trigger. Pushing there, gets the slide. Is he going to do it again? Yes, he does. That was sick. Oh, oh my oh god, boy. got greedy. He did not opt to go for the shoulder there. Yeah, that could have been a launch. Ooh, no, this is carry. huge! It's not going to kill, but he's going to do a lot of damage. He's going to get the wall here as well. Hang on, hang on a second. Wait a Is minute, maybe it will, maybe it will. Oh, AK takes it. Beautiful stuff there with the wall break. Did a lot of damage in that last hit. That's 2-1 now for AK. That was wild. What a combo, what a read on the low parry. And AK able to close it out. And now we're going to the Mishima Dojo. And Ni sticking, of course, to the Fengwei. 
Yeah, I, I know that it's not Nii's usual go-to, but the aggression that we saw in that one round where, you know, AK just didn't have an answer. I feel like a little bit more aggression would be good here. Um, obviously, Nii, you know, he's, his, he likes to go to the defensive play style. It is the... It's the less risky option, right? But AK has been matching his, his patience and, and really going blow to blow with him. Can he finish it though? That's the question. AK, 2-1. One, one more match needed. There you go, the Mishima Dojo. Will he do it? I mean, we've been seeing very close matches throughout the entire day. But right now, I feel like AK is starting to pull away. Mm. That clutch win might be enough to propel him in this particular matchup. But again, you're going up against the God, the GOAT. Bro, that down 4 2 is so sick. Side wall flat, unfortunately. But gonna get the life lead. Good stuff here. Slide. Nice slide. Good option there, especially blocking that down two. Here we go. Mm. Knee pushing the other way. This is gonna go pretty far. What's the mix? Oh, the low parry on the wake up. He got him. He should be able to kill. Yes. There it is. There it is. Good option there. Round two. Dashing up into the low parry. That was sick. Knee, what a call out. Takes the first round. Nice, good punish there from AK. Mm -hmm. Now, Nii trying to circle around here, but again, the position, he has to be careful to attach him. He gets it. The follow-up here, guaranteed. Mm -hmm. Dash up into the down forward four string. This is looking much better for Nii, but the slide to switch positions as well. That was a nice win. A little mini win there for AK. Nice down back three, able to avoid. Oh, again, clutch low parry. Here comes Nii. Mm -hmm. Gonna do a lot of damage. One mix up could do it. Oh, what? One pixel. Can you make it work? Good block. He's, he's not gonna errantly throw out the move. He's gonna wait and try to react. Mm hmm. He wants it. He wants it. Oh, oh he got oh it! My God. He got it! You better not drop the combo. You better finish your food. Oh, no! Oh, no! What the hell? How did that hit? <laughs> Even AK laughing as well. Definitely a misinput there, but it worked. It was enough. The jumping jab. The toe kick was so off axis there. He just jumped and punched his forehead. That was crazy. <laughs> um, I've never seen that ending before in my life. That was crazy. But knowing AK, maybe it was intentional. I don't know. But there, we're finally seeing the knee. Uh, so we're seeing knee going for those low parries. Uh, yeah. You know, he hasn't been challenging those lows a lot this set, but now finally challenging them. Again, that same sequence. I feel like he's going to have to be careful because back to back now on the down two, whether it was hit or block, he ended up going for the slide there. Mm -hmm. Knee's knee definitely going to be picking up on this kind of stuff. Down four two, no punish from Knee though. Down four three, that's going to be nice chunk of damage. Sidewall? Oh, sidewall saved him here. Watch out, he has the rage again. Oy. Oh, slide Nice, uh -oh, he ran up the follow up. What's he going to do? Oh, the evasive punch, get out of here. Don't even yeah. try it. Beautiful there for me. What an option. Yeah, great call out too. He knew that he was going to press. What a close set has been so far. Nice dash. In his face, mm -hmm. not letting him move, not letting him breathe. Me already pressing, look at that. Pushing him towards the wall here, but series of jabs and follow-ups here from AK. Yeah. How is he going to deal with it? I'm just waiting for that back camper. When is he going to do it? My knee has not been using it at all, but, you know, still looking nice, though, without it. Ooh. So hard to whiff punish that down 4 2 as well from Shaheen. You know, the life lead is with AK right now, too, as well. He's going to have to make a decision because we're down to our last 20 seconds of the round. Mm -hmm. This is the way that this set has gone pretty much every single time. These rounds are just whittling down all the way to the last 10 seconds. And once again, it's there. AK with the life lead. Got to be careful. Oh, he got the counter hit as well. The follow-up, what's going to happen? Oh, no the way. wall conversion. Three, two, one. Oh, he got the lead. Get out of here. Final round. Final round. AK, can he finish it though? Can he finish it and put knee into losers here? What an upset it would be. AK from the Philippines representing. What an option. Down 4-3 to the wall. Big combo. Gets the damage out of here. Goes to the low. Oh my god, there was no whiff punish there. Okay, hang on, hang on. You gotta watch out. Oh, the neutral hop kick! He was ready. He knew that he was gonna press. And here we go. Knee looking to take it. And he does with the down forward one. We are going to a final game. Final game here. 2-2. Two, two. I think we're probably gonna be going back to the Howard Estate here for our you final game. You know it. The Howard Estate. There's no other place AK would rather be 
Mm. All right, and he's taking a little bit of time, which is the right thing to do here, man. I think, you know, it can be very stressful. You know, this this is high-level Tekka right now, man. It's very mentally draining, but he's ready. He's locked and loaded. Ladies and lads, here we go. This is for a spot in winner's finals to play up against Chikorin. And there is money on the line here, too, man. That guarantees them third place. So that is $2,000 guaranteed for whoever wins this match right here. I mean, are you kidding me? That's not easy. To be able to take a character like Shaheen to go at it heads up with knees Fengwei, beat him poke to poke this is crazy this is a good match that we've been having so far and it comes down to this final game here winner of this goes on to winner's finals i feel like mark has already made a statement but it would be a bigger one if you could take this next match here we go oh, he is already he is already starting to utilize different moves he's really starting to change things up yeah oh talk to the hand cool the stop sign Big, big damage. He has, definitely has a good read on the rhythm, though. He is, he's starting to show that he, he has it. It's really changing up how AK is uh, utilizing and picking his moves. Look, he already blocked the down three there. Yeah, yeah. Oh, the from crowd three. This is interesting. How are you going to deal with it, though, AK? The adjustment will not happen in time. Threatening the slide. Look at this man again. Only 15 seconds left on the clock. There's not a lot of time to work, but he's chipping away slowly, slowly. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Oh my god. Oh, oh that could have been it. That's gonna hurt. The follow-up. Oh, what's happening? No time. The oh, the slide. Side. Oh, it's not, it's not fast enough. Not You're enough kidding. time. You're kidding. Oh the my timer. god. There was a big whiff, there was a big whiff down the, at the wall as well from Nii AK. Didn't capitalize and beaten by the timer. That was unfortunate, but knee getting away with the skin. What's the smallest happen? of margins here. AK still trying to find success there. Oh, big counter hit. Oh, I, I think yep. he messed up the crouch cancel there. Yep. Did not want the side step four. Got to get away from that wall there, AK. But see, knee is sidestepping with him. He doesn't want to let him move. Yeah, he's locking him down. Mm. Oh, he went for the boss ending too instantly. Oh, but how? Good block, oh, great block. punish. Not only that, he's getting the wall and the wall combo here. Mm -hmm. Counter oh, hit. Things Stop. are looking good for Knee in the duck. Here we go. Knee, one round away from securing a spot in a matchup with Chikorin. Can he do it? What's AK going to do? A big sidestep four. Knee, predicting that he would come in, hits him with the big launcher, and look at that, 50% gone. <laughs> what a what a sidestep forward there. Beautiful timing from Knee, and he has AK in the corner as well. Going to try and keep him there, but good sidestep from AK. Yeah, how are you going to fight now? AK, how are you going to get out of this? You did this to yourself. You let him get a read on you. Oh, my God, he landed it again. The slide again gets blocked. Bro. Okay, side wall, baby. You got to be careful. Never mind. Out of range. Okay. He has rage. Watch out for the blue. Plus frames, the low again, and Knee is going to take it in the final match, three rounds straight. Such a close set, but Knee will be moving into the winner's finals to play up against Chikorin later on today. What a set that was. AK yeah. in the loser side. You got to give it up. Knee is a monster. He turned it up so much in that last game, and he was like, you know what? I'm the best, and he showed it. That was crazy. Yeah, but I mean, like like you said, man, to take a character like Shaheen and go blow for blow, poke for poke with the with with Ni, you know, the greatest of all time, you could say. I mean, and with the form that he's in, with that Feng, dude, he definitely showed his strength at the moment. That and it's not over for him by any means. It's not over for him. AK that can definitely that, make that run with the ways. That playing. loser's bracket is messed up, bro. That loser's bracket is going to be wild later on today. Hey, you know what? His Feng way is very interesting to see how it's been evolving. He, it's like. It's unpredictable how he's going to play because he's utilizing so many of his tools. 